How do we tell the story of a pandemic as it unfolds in real time? The simple answer is data. Within this sea of numbers are the patterns that tell us what might happen next and how we might intervene to rewrite the story in our favour. In 2020, US engineer Lauren Gardner and her team redefined how we view public health data when they created their innovative COVID-19 dashboard. It cut through the noise of misinformation and became the most authoritative and trusted data source for the COVID-19 pandemic. Gardner started out as a transport engineer before taking an interest in how people's behavior influences the spread of disease. To do this, she tracks and models how diseases move around the world and has made important contributions to our understanding of Zika and measles outbreaks. Early in 2020, one of her PhD students, En Sheng Dong, was concerned about a new respiratory virus in his home country, China. At the time, no one was pulling together data on what was going on. So they decided to fix that by collating information on case numbers and plotting them on a map. Within 24 hours, they had it up and running. And when she shared it to the public on Twitter, it went viral. As the pandemic exploded, the team worked around the clock to collect data and update their dashboard. At first, this was all done manually, but later they were able to automate it. And over time, the scope of the dashboard also evolved to include deaths and later vaccination numbers. Because of the dashboard's user-friendly interface, regular updates and reliability of data, it cut through a sea of misinformation and empowered people to make informed decisions in their daily lives. It also allowed the media to accurately report on the pandemic and modelers to generate forecasts that help governments design interventions and save lives. The dashboard set a new gold standard for public health data reporting and has changed how we tell the story of a global health crisis. <laughs>